The Frankie Tomatoes restaurant competition gives post-secondary students the opportunity to develop and pitch their most creative business ideas for use in the restaurant industry. It started in 2013 after Frankie Tomatoes founder Hal Roback approached the University of Guelph with a vision to sponsor a unique student competition. After a successful start in 2014, my vision was to make the Frankie Tomatoes Restaurant Innovation Competition a national one with West Coast versus East Coast competing for the final prize on the main stage of the Restaurant Canada show. We want to give students with great ideas the connections and resources to make them happen and we want them to be recognized for their entrepreneurial creativity and business acumen. The winners of the Restaurant Innovation Competition are decided through a three-step process. To begin, student teams submit short proposals. Then, the top eight teams present their ideas to a panel of judges live here at the University of Guelph's PJ's Restaurant. The third step, the top three teams are invited to present to executives at the Restaurants Canada show in Toronto. The prizes include The top team receives appointments with legal, marketing and venture capitalists to discuss commercialization of their proposal. Welcome to the third annual Frank Tomatoes Restaurant Innovation Competition. Finalists this year hail from the School of Hospitality, Food and Tourism, Guelph University, Hospitality Management, Humber College, and Ted Rogers Hospitality and Tourism, Ryerson University. Little Grub Club is an app-based concept from Julie Giberson and Chris Chan. They're concerned about increasing childhood obesity and have decided to empower kids to make nutritional choices while dining out. This app is centered around play, encouraging friends to compete with each other while vendors advertise and promote their product and services. Nick DeGrave and his partner have created a concept to retrofit beer shelving systems. This concept will help improve the work process to become more effective and efficient while considering first in first out cleanliness and service. They recognize there's thousands of current restaurants and bars in the Toronto area alone. Catherine Gee and Sarah Herrick have created a concept called Field to Fork. They state 81% of fruits and vegetables are currently imported. That there's a disconnect between local farmers and restaurants and their restaurants want to use local goods and customers want to purchase them. They've created a purchasing group that will put these two groups together. According to Sarah and Catherine, this is good for both the environment and the economy. It's what people want and it's 100% Canadian. Good luck to all our finalists and see you at the Restaurants Canada show. This year's Restaurant Innovation Competition features five seasoned industry judges. Corey Dalton owns a consulting firm and has worked with both Turtle Jacks and Jack Astors. Neil Vosberg of Amagio Restaurants is president. Peter Shire, president of advertising company called Naked Creative. Rosanna Cara, publisher of Food Service and Hospitality magazine. And Sam Siddiqui, CFO of Tim Hortons Canada. We're fortunate and appreciative of these ladies and gentlemen's participation in this year's event. Thank you judges. See you at the Restaurants Canada Show.